All right, let's search inside the wagon. Yes, Sabina will boost a guy. For 10 gold, I will consult the all-seeing eye and tell you fortune in the future. Yes, hey. Yeah, yeah. More importantly, she casts that on us and we don't have to pay for it. And even more importantly is this little well. Oh, no, sidestep too far. Ah. I hate this game with whenever you sidestep. It's... The radiance is magically intense. The game tends to lag a little whenever you sidestep. Not a good thing to do. Okay, so we head down here. And we head into Castle White Shield. I said we head into Castle White Shield. Now, seek the four warriors north before south, east before west. Subtract the castle's name and you'll pass the test. Alright, north before south, so we head north, and then we head east. So northeast first, then northwest first, then southeast first, and then southwest first. So we make like a backward Z. You know what, I'm going to run notepad here real quick. Alright, north before south. Wait, did it say west before east or east before west? Oh, I forget. East before west. Okay, so we head east then west. Don't worry about our danger sense going off. We don't have to worry about it until we actually loot, loot stuff. Dedicated to Jodel, guardian of purity. Lost in an expedition through the frozen isles. Okay, let me write that down. Jodel. Description. Dedicated to the memory of Liebest, defender of truth lost in the taking of Evil Eye Forest. Lead best. All right. In you go. It's not like we're stealing stuff. We're just picking our way through. Don't you look at me, Danger Sense? I don't like it whenever you look at me like that. So east before west. Get down here. Yes. Dedicated to the champion of justice, Astriel, lost in the war with the gargoyles. Let me make sure I got that written down right. Astriel. Astriel. Okay, good. We have that written down correctly. Dedicated to Teshi, protector of the common good, lost in the champion against, lost in the campaign against the beasts of the Fire Isle. So Teshi. Death to Malefactor. That would be the Lord of Castle Black. Black something, I can't remember what it was. Regardless, let's head down here and. Thieves will be eradicated. Who is the overlord of Castle Wayshield? Sorry, you failed the test. Well, don't worry, you can retake the test as many times as you want. I just wanted to show you how you figure out the Lord's name, however. Prathos. Hi, Prathos. Go away. Raymond and Glee fills the hearts of those who sit at the Jester's throne. No, no thank you. Subtract the castle's name and you'll pass the test. Okay, that's the part I was missing. So we head up to here. The castle's name is White Shield.
Okay, so who's the overlord of... Yes. Who's the overlord of Castle White Shield? Okay, so the castle's name is White Shield. So anytime we see a W, we delete a letter. Anytime we see... Okay. L... White Shield. So... Delete that. Delete that. Delete the E. Well, I best... Best Teshi. Okay, I'm remembering to leave spaces. Okay, so it would be space white shield. So delete that white shield. White shield. Then we delete this. So it'd be Joe Abari. Let me, I think. Let me try this out. Joe Ab uh, R E try this. Yeah, we got it. Alright, let's turn the light on. Save our game, especially since we finally made it in here. And yes, that is a pendulum around the corner, meaning we have to deal with those kinds of traps. Let me make sure this is still recording. Alright, notes on White Shield Dungeon. Hanging from the shackles are the bones of the captured dwarves that attacked the castle. Before they were captured, the dwarves locked Zealot's treasure in magical chests that were sealed with a spell. The countersign needed to open the chests is part of the song the dwarves sang as they were storming the castle walls. Bunch of mad dwarves. That's probably what we're gonna have to deal with is just that mad dwarves. But we'll deal with that when we come to it. Bones. A single line of a song is scribbled in the dirt under the bones. Let me write this down, too. The good King Zillet was quite... quite a knave. wife and her lover, a box he gave. It's <laughs> a so character... His wife's young lover was an orc named Smello. Save our game real quick here, this looks a bit dangerous. The chalice is filled with King Zealous Divine Elixir. Drink? Well, let's have our cleric drink it. Become a more advanced adventurer. Yay! Good for a cleric. And no way around it, we just have to take this on the chin. Back down. Let's cast Levitate. I'm getting a bad feeling from a narrow hallway like this. things I tell you. Okay, that does it. If the door won't open that way, we have other ways of persuading it to open. 